Tonight, Jill Diffendahl joins the Outside the Bubble crew. Things start heating up right away. Pete has some necessary tools and accessories for his stay. And Eric makes some necessary apology calls. All that and more in this episode of Outside the Bubble. everybody thank you for joining us again if you are new here and this is your first time you missed out five amazing episodes but they're all in this same playlist so make sure to like this video and subscribe to the entertainment channel whatever link you got here true and if you're already subscribed we love you thank love you. you somebody new today chill welcome hey. Hi, everybody. you finally moved to Orlando. I I live here now. So you had to join the party. It was it was impossible. I I couldn't avoid these guys. What are you gonna do? We it's are true. gonna put you to work right away. It was hard because Pete was actually peeking in her window out the balcony. And she's like, okay, I'll join your show, Pete. Fine. <laughs> Jill, we're gonna put you to work right away. I know. You can welcome our special guests. Welcome to all of our WIGS members. Our WIGS hey. members are the PWNT Interglobe Society. If you're not a member, you can learn more at patreon.com slash WWNT. You'll get a special post show for this very show tonight if you Yay. are a WIGS member at the $7 level or higher. Wow. Wow. Well, guys, another episode. And uh, just throwing it out there. You know what? There's so much to see and do in Orlando. You cannot just do it all in one day. You got to sleep somewhere. You have to sleep somewhere, but you know, we're on a budget. We're ballers on a budget, right? Baller on a budget. Story of my life. I've done a lot of shopping, eating, going to shows, drinking. All these things cost money. Not all of us have an expensive bike. So why are you waiting? That is true. For actually, 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 all of us, all of us have, have an expensive bike. Um, but you know, why would you spend a bunch of money on the place where you're just unconscious the whole time? And right? If so, you do Orlando right, all you need is a place to sleep. That's rest correct. her ahead and move on. That's correct. So we thought... What if we had a budget of 50 bucks? 50 bucks a night, what could you do? Where could you stay outside the Disney bubble? Obviously, you're not staying inside the Disney bubble for 50 bucks. But there are places where you might be able to stay outside the bubble on a $50 budget. So we're doing this whole episode for Spencer. <laughs> <laughs> well, the, we, did, we did say, and well, we're three men in this episode. When, when we have to look for a place to stay, Pete would just sleep somewhere between the gators to keep him warm. I'm comfortable <laughs> right here, we, right now. We needed a female perspective. So we called Jill and said, Jill, you have $50 and a choice to pick out a hotel where you feel comfortable spending the night. So that's key here, where you feel comfortable spending the night. That was and not actually Jill. in the verbiage of the challenge. Agreed. Thank but you. That yeah. was presented to Jill that way, perhaps by Axel, because he well, changed gentleman. the rules. <laughs> yeah. Maybe also, he changed she the needed rules. to join, and in the TripAdvisor reviews, the word cockroach, crab pent, what was that? Needles. A bit. Scabies. But <laughs> none of that. Jill, you did find a place to stay. I did. So, and it's important to steer these people in the right direction, a place they could actually legitimately stay. We already have first time a female here. Normally you always have to say, Pete, shut, shut up. up. But this time, but this time, Jill, Jill just could go for it. Jill, let's have a look at your hotel. I have to pick a hotel to stay uh, off property that is a budget conscious choice and I wanted to pick something that was still within our budget but still also not a place where you'd be afraid to stay or afraid to touch your face to the pillow nobody wants that kind of hotel and so I chose the Rosen Lake Buena Vista right here behind me uh, I have stayed at a Rosen before I had a very lovely experience they are inexpensive and yet give you a really good uh, experience for your money. Uh, there are signs by the water feature that warn you about alligators, but hey, what are you going to do? 
Um, so I'm here at the Rosen and so I uh, got a hold of Axel and Eric and told them they should come over and check out my choice. Welcome gentlemen to the Rosen Inn, Lake the Buena Rosen, Vista. The Rosen Inn for $50. For a budget. For a budget. So Rosen, uh, the, yeah. the hospitality school at UCF is named after him. It is. But I swear to God, like an hour ago, this was a clarion. This is the Rosen. This is not You got like, it for under 50 bucks? Find a cheap hotel. Does that include, so park, was, does that include parking and resort fee? It was 54 your first episode she started we'll give you a little we'll let you cheat it's your first episode it's only like marginally cheating it's like a couple dollars worth well, of cheating i think we have to check it out uh, jill we're glad you're here they know i'm coming they're glad i'm here Ah, you didn't tell me you were staying at the boardwalk. Oh, we oui, oui. Let me explain to you a little bit about the Rosen Lake Buena Vista and why it is the superior choice in a superior location. First of all, we are right here on this lovely patio. There are nice chairs. There's a water feature right over there. There's nice green Hold grass. Hold on, Joe. I'm having trouble hearing you. Is that I have four? Okay, it's I-4, but look how perfectly located we are right off of I-4. It's so easy to get to from the airport or any other location right there. in Orlando. It's like I know, staying but next a, to the airport. You can walk to the outlet mall, though, There's a across whole the water. Street. There's a whole lake in between you and I-4. You, you the could... outlet mall where where the Disney outlet store, where you, where actually you personally have gotten some really good, inexpensive yeah. Disney merchandise, is literally right on the other side of I-4 from here. We haven't yet. even seen the room yet. Once you see the room, you uh, will just, you will be done. Well, you will, we'll talk you later. will bow down and Jill's acknowledge palace. this show, is show the us right the room. place. Show right, us the room. Let's do it. Now, Jill, we can see the buffet is open. <laughs> Look, it's like they're recreating Kitchen Cabaret right here for you. <laughs> he won't forget the lick-in. He got from that big chicken. And there's, he gets his poultry at least there's store. ketchup here. Heinz, Heinz. Heinz. Ketchup. Mustard. It's like it's like you're on dinosaur. There's your own ketchup and mustard. Beautiful. Supply. Ladies and gentlemen, let's check this out. By the way, where's your key? Where's the other thing the key came in? I wanted to point something out. Oh. Uh, never mind. Uh, there's a. Well, I think on the key it says uh, something else as well. You forgot your um, parking slip. Oh yeah, but look, I told you it was like a clarion an hour Five ago. Five minutes ago, yeah. it was a clarion in. But now it is a rosin. And you are going to be very impressed at how nice this room is I'm, for the price. I'm, all, I'm, all Ooh, very, I'm already very impressed by seeing this. Oh, wee oui, wee. Oui. There you go. <laughs> wow. Oh, <laughs> smells delightful. Ooh, what does it right smell there? like? It smells, it like, smells like it used to be a smoking room. <laughs> it's not it smells like it used to be a smoking room like yesterday. All right, all I want to say is Jason and I spent more money on a hotel off of 95 in South Carolina than we did on this room, and this room is way nicer. Plus you have five pillows. Well, five pillows. You have a nice chair. Look at this nice chair. It's fantastic. Oh, but sitting on it's like having a nicotine patch. There's a TV. <laughs> all right. There's a microwave and a there's a microwave and a fridge. I feel There's like a hair dryer. I feel like in a French hotel. There's oh, a coffee wait. maker. In plastic? Still wrapped? It's, it's still wrapped? It's sanitized. It's sanitized. There's oh. an ice bucket. An this ice is bucket. way more than you get for you, a way you're, 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 you have way. This is basically a, a Disney value resort without a bus. It kind of is. It just smells It might even worse. have a bus. I don't even know. Does I think it have they, a bus? The last rose and I stayed at has a bus. I don't know if this one does, but the last one I stayed at did. In all capitals, no liability. Um, Eric, I... There's a desk and a desk chair. This is as nice as the desk chairs we had in the WWT old street. Uh, is, I mean, it's, it could be worse. Uh, it's not bad. Uh, there are Disney worse. hotels this is nicer than. I mean, I was in, in Saratoga Springs, old no. room that smelled more than this. 
Uh, but, but, Jill, it is your, your first outside the bubble. Not bad. Um, we had $50. How much did you end up spending in total? It was $54 for 50. the room. And then with your tax, I believe I saw that little card 62. 62. That is... Dude, for $62. It's I have stayed in more. way worse hotel rooms for way more money than this room. But the challenge was and fifty dollars. And some of them are on Disney property. I mean, we invited you to do a challenge. And it was fifty bucks. She Jeez. shows up and starts cheating. I it's like it's like she that takes right to is it. Part of what happens on outside it's the like, bubble. Oh, fifty bucks, king of the castle, king, king of the castle, of the castle. <laughs> queen um, of the castle. Thank I don't you very know, much. I think I can beat that fifty dollars. I think I can beat it too. I can get cheaper. Okay. I'm going to call somebody. You call somebody. And I'll find somebody. They got a guy. What are you going to do? Got a guy. Hello? Hey, hold on, hold on the phone. Hey, this is Eric Morton. Yes, that Eric Morton. Universal Parks News today. Um, I'm looking for a good deal on a room. Um, really, we only have to beat this $50 place that was $62. Can you hook me up? Yeah, yeah, no. 18 people or less? I think we're good. Yep, I'll send you my digits. All right, cool. Thanks. Congratulations, Jill. Well done. You you tried. You overspent. overspent. I learned from watching you guys. Yeah, I learned it from watching you, Dad. Uh... Aside from the cigarette odor in that room, which I, if you're if you were in there for a while, it kind of you get used to it. I think it's like well, yeah, if you if you like lay in a bed full of scabies, you get used to it after a while. That doesn't, I mean, people were smoking on that hallway. Like I, I cut them some. That's a very there. European. It's a very European hotel. <laughs> oh, there oh, wait, wait. Um, I thought it was it was it had a bar that was closed. Uh, it had a gift shop that was open. It had a buffet, a buffet-ish area that was kind of closed, but it had like, it had like a vibe like a real hotel, right? It wasn't. Yeah. It didn't feel unsafe. There was a security gate. Where, granted, I drove up and the guy said, "Yeah, going in." But was this the old Claron LBV with the splash pad? Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. There is there is a kid. Did you miss that part where he said part. this was a Claron? No, I don't. Like four minutes ago, I heard you say that, but I because I didn't when you said you went to a Rosen, I wasn't. You're sure thinking it's further one. up. I was I thinking four. up yeah. by Orlando, right? Uh, I drive Universal yeah. Orlando. Uh, yeah. Oh, so now I know what you're talking about. This is the one with the splash pad by Kitty O'Shea's. Yes. Right yeah. You can walk to Kitty O'Shea's or or, or go through pizza. the climb a fence. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> And close to CC's Pizza. Could we? Can we located. We so we did. So when you don't I've feel been, well, you can immediately. You go can run out. to your hotel room. Yeah. yeah, and we're not allowed to uh, give away CC coupons anymore. Uh, I'm sorry for the person who. That was from legal. I came out from legal. Yes. Um, I, I think you did a good job. I think it was a decent <laughs> pick. It's not our best pick by any means, but it was decent. You did. It's, a, it's so this is getting. When I thought fifty dollars, like for fifty bucks or less, sixty-two, and I know it's it's that's a after tax, is, right? Yeah, but then if you see some of the deals you can get as a universal pass holder, they can do like seventy bucks a night on on a Cabana like Bay dockside or um, no Surfside right? Cabana Bay and like dockside yeah. Surfside were, were less than that. Yeah. So it depends on the time of the year. Yeah, you, 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 they'll tag year. you for like a resort. Now we're coming into the summer season. months. It's a different season. This is and, January, and this was filmed like this week. We said like this we was this week. To give it. I didn't know this was the hotel feeling. you guys stayed in because I've actually stayed in this place like three, four times. It's nice, right? Yeah, we asked for the carny suite. No, uh, like, no, it, no. Sir. Only, only if we like really need to save money, we booked a last minute trip. Uh, we were there one night where the fire alarms went off at four a.m. and they took every single person out of their room, Pete, made them stand the in the parking day? lot, and then the and then I was the only one smart enough to disobey and go back in. So I was like, this is going to take hours. They had to have the fire department search every room because they couldn't tell where the fire started. Pete, why are you um, doing this to me? So 
Is well, that... I'm just saying, this is a true story. So we emptied our room. So the fire alarm is highly functional, uh, which is better than like accurate. staying at the old uh, MGM Grand in Vegas. Is that... Or we got to Animal Kingdom four hours early for no reason. But yeah. Is that the reason why when we said, hey, Pete, we're going to this Rose Then the physics. Well, um, I have to go, go to, to the dentist. dentist. <laughs> you, Pete was noticeably absent from there. He was at the dentist. Um, now, normally, and, and as it always goes, everybody gets to pick his place. I thought that I had to be like under $50. And when I started looking, I found places that were 25 to 35 Um but then also I wanted to be able to tell our audience about that. And that didn't look like it was going to be the case when staying at that hotel. People depend on you to be here on Thursdays, Axel. And then I'm shooting when Eric is coming out I will... on his phone and I hear 18 or less. Yeah. So that's when in our... I mean, technically back, you could sleep 18 in Jill's room. Like, they sleep 18 cheerleaders in the All-Stars, right? No, you have to be over 18. Sure. It was written. All right, Nick. <laughs> Yikes. Uh, I did call Eric and ask if we could. It's not cheating, but more if you sharing. could co If you could coattail. Ride Absolutely. my coattails on the next By now, if you have not seen our lives, um, we are WWE's cutest couple. Pretty, pretty much. Um, so... I asked Eric if I could stay, and I, I, I was allowed. Of course. And then, well, after a quite a drive, we arrived at this place. Hey, Eric. Thank you very much. You were able. So I couldn't find anything that was really cheap. It's okay. I pulled a few strings, and I have a couple extra rooms available. So oh, yeah. you're one of my best friends. So, so here we are. I'm the only one you invited to come over here? Eric, I, I didn't say that. that. No, I, I got to invite all my friends, but the, like you don't have to find it. You don't have to pay for a place. They can't stay here. They, they can hang out here. They can't stay here. Oh, but I can stay with you. That's correct. So you invited more people? Yeah, there'd be some more people along directly. Sh shall we wait for more people? Are there are more people coming. Hold on. Eventually. I called in some favors, though. I, I think I think you're going to be pretty stoked about this one it's already impressive from the outside i i do want to i do want to note that i share half of the points with eric that's I'm, true i'm sleeping here as well correct so i i just wanted to cut you in on this i figured this is a, a unique experience i'm gonna camp in the tesla tonight yeah <laughs> can i fit into the um, compartment eric yeah, yeah of course. what are we waiting what for um <laughs> follow me but be careful this Here is, we are. This is Here's my hotel room. room. You have a foyer. I, there's a lot of there's a lot to show you in here, Axel. I'll just start. This this is the first room when you walk in. Welcome to Jurassic Park. Oh, oh please get off the bed. <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. This is great. Yeah, this is this is kind of different, eh? Very nice. All right, Eric. What's next? Uh, look, we have. Um, our Jeff Goldblum's extra stuff. Chris Pratt left his gloves here. <laughs> is a yeah bathroom. Yeah. This is the garage. You made it. <laughs> so okay. All right, Eric. Yeah. Where are you? I lost you already. It's easy to get lost here. Be very careful. Don't get separated. Oh my God! It's just a dinosaur. It's it's, a, it's just another dinosaur. Is this a? Erica? Oh, like, where this is that? Where it's a museum. Okay. Is, but also, you can learn, follow me down the hall. You can learn right? something. The Triceratops. It sounds like Tyler Men. Most popular dinosaur. Oh my God! It doesn't sound like Tyler Men. Distinguishing feature is its massive skull. Dinosaur? Who's got a more massive skull? Me or this dinosaur? And featured a large frill. I got a pretty big head. <laughs> okay, people. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
this this is a whole living room, Eric. Yeah, I know. There's there's a table. Look at the this. Actually, you know how I live, right? You have a patio. This is how I live. I don't. They have activities. Look at, look at the size of this table, by the way. You can actually eat a brontosaurus on this table. But do you have a patio? Oh, yeah, come on out. There's a scavenger hunt. No, I don't have the big community pool like Jill had at her resort. So she might outkick me there. We just have a small pool and a small hot tub. So is there other people coming to swim here? Uh, it's just for us. Oh, so uh, Jill said grill. More, more people there. We did. I had a water park at my hotel. Yeah, but we, look, we don't share with the normal people here, all right? You're with me. All right, so Pete, this was it. What do you think? No, there's, there's more. No. This there's is more. Oh, is there like more. a closet we haven't on, seen? I saw all the stairs. Push the button. We'll get we'll get the hang of it. We'll get the hang of it. Uh, it's very safe for children. Very safe for children. This is like the me. biggest dining room. Oh, no Harry Potter room. Seen. Follow me. Here, check out. We excavated a fossil. It's okay. Pete is gonna explode. Uh, Eric, what are what are these doors? Oh, do you want to do these first? Okay. Um, so more dinosaur theming. You know, if you need it. What so, goat? Here we go. Just save, you should save this one for later. Here we go. The what underwater the dinosaurs. I love this. Under the sea. That's called a fishosaur. A fishosaur? Yeah. A, a sharkosaur. You guys are lucky with some of those wet feet. This is. This is pretty trippy. Pete, this, you this is the room I want. Do yeah. you feel at home? I do. I really. This is my home. I'm already starting to get pruny. <laughs> yeah, come up for air. <laughs> All right, sorry. That was it? No, come on. No, no, do that one later, do that one later. Go that way. Let's go this way. Here's another living room, Eric. Another living room. I gotta close this door. Hey, hey, it's not a full living room. It's just, you know, for like if you have guests over, like where the kids would go maybe. The, $50 the low rent it? district. Eric, right, we had we had a deal. Like I'm not paying half this. I cannot, I thought we were. No, 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 no. We didn't, we didn't, we're good. This room's a little scary. Well, I don't know. I, it's a little scary. Let's see, Let's see if you like it. Look at this. We got Pete I on a volcano. Am erupting with joy in this room. This is amazing. Wait the volcano it. is erupting. <laughs> oh, oh, they, yeah. have, they have like legit ash and meteor and rock falling on the ceiling around us. We're not going to make it. We're not. <laughs> I knew we would. This is actually the Dr. Seeker quarters. So, right. uh, do you want to see more? Is there have you more? Seen enough? Yeah, I've seen enough. Or... Special. 18 people paying. <laughs> I guess. This is where we can, you know, watch movies, make popcorn. Do you have a home cinema? Yeah. I don't know why people are staying at these, like, junky hotels for 50 bucks. So the thing, what creeps me out is I'm, I'm not a fan of dinosaurs and monsters. Yeah. Because behind every corner, there's a freaking... Ah! Chase a different dog? A Diffosaurus! It's a Diffraptor! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but mine was close uh, to an AMC. Eric, is there, is that? Is there someone in the shower? And this is Shadow. You already named it? Oh. Do you so want me to open a door? So another bathroom? Oh, nothing in here. Yeah. Did you think that was a real dinosaur? I thought there might be a dinosaur egg uh, or something. But these doors are all closed. This is going to nowhere? Is no, 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 no. The pterodactyl and Pete, he's been carried off. Take me to heaven, baby! Okay, this is cool. This is, this is it now. Nope, there's more. You want, you want, there's a little bit more room. If there's we want to bring room? more people, there's a little bit more room. A little bit. This is where actually where the Diffin dolls are sleeping. I get top on. Double and same. Like, but the what? Oh my God! 
gonna need a minute. Uh, just, Sorry. just finishing Sorry. up. Sorry. We're just gonna walk through. Sorry, Pete. We're just passing through. All right, it's okay, buddy. Don't be scared. Yeah, so <laughs> this is what happens when you so, roll with me. Here's the thing, Eric. I have seen these bets before. Yeah? Uh, you can like freak out if you sleep here. Just, you turn around, and you hit. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah. Look, they got little charging ports. Uh huh. But this, this is amazing. Before the meteor hits, if you want to die with clean clothes, washer and dryer, right here. And Eric, is this so? This is like the downstairs is more of the fossil part, and then the upstairs is more of the real dinosaur. Yeah, exactly. Part. The downstairs is the below ground, right? It's the fossil was. Um, the fossil I also just found there. another bathroom. How Eric, is there more bathrooms? Eric, there's more bathrooms. There's another bathroom. Remember we were in the media room with the volcano erupting? This whole theme of this bathroom. Oh. There have been some eruptions in here, let me tell you. Pete, Pete has erupted here. <laughs> oh, Pete. Guys. Pete. <laughs> Pete is now extinct. Um, Eric, <laughs> yeah. um, let's, go, let's go sit down for a minute. I think okay. we need to talk. Okay. Now, look, look at this place, Eric. Um, this, so, is, is that an Xbox? Yeah, with four controllers. Actually, no, there's an Xbox. Yeah, it's an Xbox with four controllers. So, Eric. Why would you want to play games if you're here, though? Um, we, we had, a, we had a, a deal. Jill overspent. She spent $4. Yeah, $62. Plus tax. $4 plus tax. plus tax. Pete was way below that. Our budget. Wait, wait. In for a penny, in for a pound. Jill went over, I went over, so what? Yeah, but no, we said like, it had, this is not 50, how did you get this house? Okay, how much? How much? Well, <laughs> um, right now I think I'm the lowest number because it's zero dollars because the good people at Loma Homes appreciate our work and wanted to show us this home. You and hold a peep Cardi. I'm so happy, I'm so happy. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I repeated the peep. You won. <laughs> here on Outside the Bubble, but I thought that the purpose of Outside the Bubble was to show viewers at home what is feasible for them within a well, budget. If Eric, I, I took, I had counts. Yeah. You can sleep 18 people here. Right. And you set the average price you can get this home starting at about $400. Right. So which, divide that by, divided 18. by 18. Nobody can count. My parents Her also always made me pay when I was a kid, so. Um, so, yeah. the most important thing, I promise to pay you half of zero. How much? Thank you, sir. How much is half oh, of zero? Yeah. It, uh, I don't, Jason's, Jason's the guy that went to MIT. I don't really know with math, but it's yes. probably 50 bucks. <laughs> Jason. Somebody call? Screaming <laughs> in the background. <laughs> That's amazing. Jason, you know what? Jason. I applaud you. You pull the peak party, you know, I love it. Go ahead, I'll give it I have six episodes it took me to start cheating. I've played by the rules for five episodes. I'm proud of you. I feel like this is my time to shine. Go ahead, the solve rest the world of you is away. I gotta call in a favor every now and then. Thank you again, Loma Holmes. Loma Holmes hooking Eric up. I, I just Hey Eric, thank you very much. You were able so I So our showrunner for tonight, Jason Diffendall is sitting in the room next to us, yes. probably with the liquor cabinet wide open tonight. <laughs> I think we left some mushrooms, uh, some, <laughs> some gummy, bears. Yeah, gummy bears. Yeah, he's having a good time out there, but uh, thanks again to Jason. Love, Love Jason. That was great. It, that house was insane. That house is ridiculous. We had a great barbecue grill, we cooked oh. out. We, yeah. this one, those rooms are scary. I just shook the smell of barbecue for my skin. So I will say one thing. If you have a significant other, that special someone, many of these rooms have interactive features where you hit a button and something happens. Could be interesting. Spice up your life a little bit. No, it, I hit Lori's button. No, go ahead, sweat. <laughs> that house was, was um, pretty amazing. The only downside, it is an amazing house. Eric, 
Where is this beautiful house located? It's located in Champions Oh Gate. my god, that's a lifetime away. Bit of a haul. Champions oh Gate, a few exits to exit 58, right? It's Champions Gate. So down that area, you need um, a full tank of gas, patience. Two hours to sit through all the Well, it was, it was rush day. hour when we went there. It's, it's rush, rush hour all but, the time uh, to Champions Gate. But, but, also to Eric's point, if you want a highly teamed room, in a Disney or Universal Resort, you got to pay a lot of money. Here, one room after another is just it was teams. incredible, terrifying rooms. The vo exploding volcano, the the volcanic bathroom, the fact that the they had the um, surely lava like, soap in there. Right? Yeah, no, I mean, first of all, they had soap on the bottom floor that said "You are handsome." I love that, yeah. but the, the fact the bottom floor was all like archaeology and fossils right, then you right, go upstairs right. and it's like a living resort it was very very nice. i saw people in the chat ask if that's my home no second home not my <laughs> exactly <laughs> no you gotta have an income stream yeah, yeah of course your, your home is bigger than that right oh, oh no, no sure you can fit three t-rexes in this home less teams i have a more, more terrifying creature running around my house <laughs> poppy the velociraptor poppy the, velo <laughs> the velocipomeranian yeah. she'll sure oh. get you I think that you did a great job, Eric. And I don't say Fantastic. that because Fantastic. I love sharing it with you. Um, I'm not saying that because we're sharing this this uh -huh. thing. Um, so if you win, we both win. We um, all won. There's no losers in this competition. That's we true. did all have all a very nice Well, time. actually. Well, wait, 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 wait. wait. There's, there's really I am happy that I got to provide you guys with a piece of movie history. But just like... And to Jill's, well, we're gonna we have to defend our guest here for Eric. We we looked up the prices. They go at the end of the four hundreds up to high season next year, a thousand dollars a night. Divided by eighteen people. people. 18 I'll people. give them some credit because you make the kids pay. Private, you pool. make the kids pay, or you make adults sleep in a bunk bed, or you make adults sleep in bunk beds. I'm just saying, 18 people at a thousand dollars a night is still more than fifty dollars a person. Okay, but you we're not talking peaks. Put season. a few more people in there, and they can sleep in the theater. I'm on Team Eric. I <laughs> love that he pulled this off. I thought it was awesome. Even well, though I couldn't finally, use, I couldn't. My use, moment has arrived. After um, losing every competition we've had. I mean, so far. We haven't seen my amazing resort. True. Before we go to your resort, it is kind of funny that you got to stay at this house on the grand opening of the Velocicoaster. That is I true. Thought, today. So, today. So, oh, wow. Right after this, go check out UPNT where Eric tells you all about the Velocicoaster. Universal Parks News Today, our yes. sister station. I recorded the show today. The Velocicoaster opened today. Great show. We couldn't show, but Keenan Thompson also stayed with us at the Raptor Retreat. <laughs> Remember the time you guys put the live stream in the locker? <laughs> I did. I was going to watch that one. Um, the live stream. If you want to be in a that locker. That was a dark, dark moment. moment. If you thought Literally. 250 people couldn't fit in a locker, you were mistaken. <laughs> I'm happy we ended this conversation right here. All right, listen. Ready. Let's let's transition. Let's <laughs> transition. Oh, moving on. Moving let's on. transition. Um, so you guys have really brought some competition and heat, and uh, I don't want to give too much away, but a great discount at a great location, an amazing Raptor retreat. But what if I told you you can stay on an actual Hollywood? filming location there's a theme park here that used to be a hollywood filming location now it just has like toy star wars and, and toy story yeah but so i'm bringing it to you i don't want to give too much away should we just watch did you did you you didn't put a bet in, in the thing with the blue man group did you let's you told you we won't that. know i think we should just roll the clip let's see if Jason... hey everybody so welcome to my choice now you may be asking yourself this doesn't look you know, super high end. We've we've seen uh, you know nice places here in Orlando. However, are any of those other locations a world famous filming location? In the 2017 film The Florida Project, starring Willem Dafoe, which earned him supporting actor nominations at the Academy Awards, the BAFTAs, the SAG Awards, Golden Globes, all filmed right here at this hotel. 
you notice Axel's not here. Like he had something come up as soon as we told him where you were. I thought that was a little. I thought that was a little shady. I mean, I thought he would oh. want to see a piece of history. I'm sorry, but you have no right to use the word shady when you brought us here. No, there's. If you go over there, there's some shade. Did um, you say the Florida Project right, or the shift. Florida Projects? The Florida Project. It's a great movie. Everyone should go watch it. Um, and I mean, this is history. When they, saying, when they say you should be fully vaccinated, they're not just talking about COVID. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I did bring some tools. I'll show you. They're in my car. All right, let's go. Let's go let's check go out the room. room. All right. All right. I did Please bring. I door. mean, I pack pretty lightly when I come here. Uh, I just bring some <laughs> gloves, bleach, <laughs> just to be safe. Is I mean, there a right, and a shovel in your car. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> if not your car, somebody else is in the parking lot. It's very scenic, by the way. And the helicopter takes off here, uh, you know, every half hour. So. <laughs> here, oh, oh first my. of all, the aroma. Breathe it in. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, my God. That is Florida I, humidity. That That is the worst smell. Look at this. We got the love bug. We oh, it's themed. All-star movies. We have Woody and Bo Peep. Oh, my God. All right, so oh, the, the smell. The smell. I used to do asbestos-leaded mold work in New York. You're gonna need all three of those. There's a, there's a <laughs> problem in this room. Holy cow! Jesus, it is palpable. Get the Holy bleach out. I went, can I just smell the bleach to yeah. clear my yeah, my sense of smell? Look how current this room is. Corella Deville is. Yeah, Corella just came out, and now she's is this a Disney Magic resort? Magic this, you're at the Magic Castle. This is it. Um, sanitize and clean for your pleasure. Oh, my God. oh yeah, um, they got the they got the sticker on it, so you know it's clean. Oh my god, that smell. I mean, it could use... They're, they're doing some patchwork in the bathroom on oh the ceiling. Oh my god, this is... Pete. This is nice. Look, does every room have a microwave and a fridge this big? Open no. the, I, I'm afraid to ask you to open the fridge, but there we go. Okay. It's not bad. It's not better than The cable... Uh, the walls... Well, they, there's sort you, of a you paint may, problem you here. May, you may be thinking they sell pieces where this can just go through the middle, but no. <laughs> no, no, no. That's not how that works. All right, we we got it. We got some like tested in. On the on the dresser are like warped and melted. They got flat screen TVs though. Yeah. Samsung, Samsung. It's not even like insignia or Vizio. something, right? Yeah, it's legit. Also, I don't know if you noticed when we checked in, your deposit can be left by credit card or just cash. Yeah, Maybe I'm gonna give them cash. a cash deposit. <laughs> they the, they by the way, here. by the way, this they place do, and monthly. Yeah, it comes. <laughs> it comes with free breakfast. But yeah. But, of course, because of COVID, they're not COVID, doing breakfast because no they care about cleanliness and They safety. also run out of Pop-Tarts, uh, so, <laughs> you know, because COVID. Wow. Oh, my God, the smell it here. Is, I feel so, bad for people who have to sleep in here. It's oh. so pungent. Yikes. Oh, my God. Well, let's, let's do some let's testing. Let's do some testing. All right. right. You want me to grab the, All right, we're at the here, close of the door. we got to shut the door. Oh, God. Okay. Jason's here just to Jason guarding. Jason can't come in because the smell makes him want to vomit. Yeah. Oh, it makes me actually vomit. Sure. All right, so... uh you brought a tool. It's not dark enough yet, maybe, but... Oh, that's black. definitely a black light. Oh, I'm afraid already. Should we start with, like, the walls? It's a little darker. Oh, yeah. I'm, I'm we, afraid. Should we do this, Pete? Uh, oh, no, look at that pillowcase. Oh, God. Actually, it's not terrible, terrible? No, actually, I'm kind of shocked. You know, they use bleach the when they do these things. Are a disturbing. I'm that sure there's stuff. The I'm sure there's yeah, stuff they... on the... On, wait, go down there again? No. <laughs> that'll be the headboard. I mean, they don't wipe that down. Oh, oh, oh what oh, is wow. this? Oh, God. Uh, <laughs> Peter North was the last guest. Here. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, wow. Look at that. Oh, boy. That could just be the mold we're spelling. <laughs> Look at that clock. Here, what year is that clock from? Oh, uh, it, it doesn't matter. It's not on. Should we try bed number two? Uh, no, I don't think the sheets are the problem. I think it's going to be the bedspread. It'll be underneath the bedspread. Yeah, yeah it's going to be like It'll be, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> there we go. That's where the good stuff is. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. How dare, they, how dare they defile my mighty ducks? The bathroom just, uh, I mean, it looks pretty clean around here. What? 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 Oh my god. 
You okay, Sean? Guys, this is like... <laughs> this show is... This is great. I can't. I can't. I... I need to go to the bathroom. This is bad. This is so bad. I don't bad. know if the bathroom's a better choice. Oh, God. I'm so scared. I'm pretty sure somebody was murdered in here, and it smells like... I don't even know. Like... It's... Oh, God. It's so bad. Before I show you the beautiful sights outside, you can kind of get a preview by just looking through your air conditioner. Look. Hi, guys. Oh, it's Pete. <laughs> <laughs> Some bugs can get in. Look at this beautiful pool. Can get in. <laughs> snakes. What if I need to do some laundry? Oh, there's a beautiful washer dryer. I'll, I'll show well, you. Before, I, how much does this cost? Oh, this yeah, this could be yours for. How much does this cost? Well, if you're Actually, only staying for one here. night, there's a re here. Hold it. Oh, mm -hmm. Grab that receipt, Jill. If you're only staying for one night, it's a little more expensive. I believe it's sixty-two dollars. Sixty-two dollars and seventy-four. But if you stay for Jill, a month, wait, compared to where cheaper. Jill stayed. Wait, wait, wait. How much was my hotel? Sixty-two dollars. Sixty-two dollars. Did you have There's all no, of this plus a free breakfast? That's just not happening. Right and now? were you at a world-famous filming location? I was not at a world-famous filming location. However, do you think Willem Dafoe single... stayed here while they were filming? <laughs> no. oh, I mean, I'm sure he ate lunch here. I mean, they see a method guy walking, walking and painting the sidewalk. Slept in his car and had better accommodations than this. Wow, how dare you! So, if you stay at Wilderness Lodge, you have Geyser Point. We have Point. we have something similar, and also nice picnic tables, playground. Yeah, very nice. Not bad. Uh -huh. You're probably asking, is there a place you can grill? Yeah, there is. Absolutely. Oh, yeah. There's a <laughs> community grill. I don't know that Jill, it's community. Jill, what do you think? I, I wouldn't or, use is that Is that somebody's grill private grill? I'd be concerned that someone you probably have to would be come like, out and get very angry with me. For you probably have to be a member or yeah, yeah. one of the high-end, like concierge. Yeah. All right. All right, here we are around the back. This is where we yeah, do our laundry. So, there are people here. Yeah, there are people here hanging out. I mean, of course there are because it's a great resort. Uh, but instead of going all the way to the laundromat to do your clothes, there is a coin laundry right here in the back of Magic Castle. Do you have anything to wash, Joe? Uh, I'm really glad I bought, brought my bottle of hand sanitizer. Yeah, we're going to need <laughs> a bigger lie. bottle. <laughs> I just used it in the car, too. <laughs> oh, boy. We're going to need a bigger this, bottle. This is going to be enough to coat all of my exposed skin right now. So, I, Pete, I, I feel like you've lost, like... Listen, it depends like, on how we're judging like this contest. No, because, I mean, if you're going on just hotel, like, how beautiful it is, yeah, maybe I lost there. But if you're going on something historic, a piece of history, a landmark in the Orlando area, I think I have a real shot. Jill got sick and went catatonic in the bathroom. You know what? She, it's its her first outside the bubble. She's not used to this lap of luxury that we normally deal with. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Eric took me to the Raptor house in a gated community. That happens next. <laughs> we didn't do that yet. No, we did. It's the last one. Okay. <laughs> it's the last one. Look, I took you to the Rosen Inn, like Buena Vista, for slightly like pennies cheaper than this place. Oh, it don't get me not, wrong. It was not too gross to sleep in. We did not need a black light. It did not smell like rotted internal organs. Well, these are all great points. But again, was the Rosen Inn in a featured film that won at Cannes Film Festival? Festival? Festival, I believe is the word. No. So here it is, a piece of history. You can come and look at this place, though, without spending money to sleep here and probably get hepatitis and or mug. I was looking True. forward to the free breakfast, and they're like, no, sorry, safety. Safety and health first. Well, I will leave it up to our great fans of Outside the Bubble. I think this is a, a sneaky chance of uh, possibly winning. Wow. Wow, what a pick. What a pick. <laughs> Hollywood filming location, Willem Dafoe, uh, you know, stayed there, like lived it. You go, if you haven't seen the Florida Project, go watch it. It is fantastic. They, by the way, the, the co-writer of the Florida Project is a friend of the show. He is. He's, he's actually been in our studio. He's been he watched the news tonight. Yeah, he was Chris, there. Yeah. Chris has been in the news As well as the studio. DOP, yeah. Uh, very, it's, and it's a great movie. It you did not result part. in a discount for us. But after watching that, you should go watch the movie. But, man, what? how cool is that? A Hollywood filming location for $62? 
Unbelievable. Um, so I am going to I, first of all, don't don't give us a thumbs down for for this. Give us a thumbs up. Give Jill a thumbs up. They risked their lives. You know what? Give was, one of the four of us a thumbs up because you know what? We don't have enough likes on this video. We, we, we need more people to find this. We found so, Joe catatonic in a bathroom. Give her a like for that. She's going to need therapy. We so, did have to pull her out of there pretty quickly. Let me I was, tell you, when this video started playing again tonight, we were sitting here like I smelled kind it. of getting nauseous. You could smell it all over again. It's like I did feel, sensory PTSD. Yeah. I'm sorry. It, it's, not, it's, like, it's like mold. I felt really bad. I don't know. If there is a combination of like, uh, just like, if you were to live in a basement next to a swamp forever, it was the mold in an old car. A picture of a 50 year old car. It did smell so, so bad. It smelled. Uh, look, I will tell you, as we know, I was in the Marine Corps. I slept on the ground in gravel in Haiti. In Haiti, on the ground. I slept on the floor whoa, of the whoa, office whoa. building. You don't have to brag. You took us to a place yeah. where the floors were over millions of years old with yeah, dinosaurs, yeah. and it smelled better. I slept on the floor of an office building in Monrovia, Liberia for three months. You slept on the floor of I the would studio. Go back in time and sleep in either of those places before I would spend the night in that place. But, but I will say I felt a little guilty because... They, it, $62, first of all, is a, a total ripoff. It is cheaper if you pay by the month. There are people, like, I didn't think my heart when goes we did, out right? This, when, yeah. we did, when we did this, like, yeah. we're like, oh, let's come up with clever places for people to stay. I didn't want this to be poverty point. I felt there really bad. No, that, so like, I felt really bad. I wanted, like, that. like, we obviously, everyone knows I go for the joke and I have a good time. And you had an amazing place at the Raptor Retreat. And we were showing other real actual discounts that you could have near the resort uh, with our noob, Jill. But... I was like, all right, what else could be interesting and fun? And this is near the resorts, and it was a filming location. But I did not expect it to be as bad as it was, and I felt really bad once we booked it. We actually paid for the room, got a key. We were we were even thinking about staying and there. They, the they, had me, they handed us a list of rules like this yeah. long, right? So I, and, I, and I was like, all right, I've stayed in some bad or shady places in my day. And we've talked about it in the car right here. We've stayed in some bad places. Uh, I I was doing it for the fun of it, and it's a it, and again it, it's an actual filming location. But uh, by no means am I making fun of anyone who has to stay in this location. And my heart goes out for them because this place because, needs an, oh my god it needs an overhaul. And I would have deemed it <laughs> unsafe on Long Island when so, that was my job. So I was a smart one. I set this one out very smart. But I did have the pleasure of editing this, and all of a sudden I have like videos from Jason. I was like, Jason, were you there? It's like, yeah. Jason did not set one foot inside that room. No, he not wouldn't. He walked in. He went like this. It us. was like a stutter stuff. He went like this and back out. And that was it. He just stood in the doorway and filmed it from the doorway because he couldn't. It is like, I have like, I have a scab I can't explain above my eye right now. <laughs> like, I I don't so know what's up with that place. What, what happened in that bathroom? That I mean, some I don't remember it. <laughs> I is it, did you open a door next door and there was a lady that <laughs> it was. Let's just say the wait time for the bathroom was shorter than not be remembered. I, I will say this: we chose not to spend a night in this hotel. We did, we did, which we is a shame. Work. Yeah, I mean, That's I could have told way more stories. I. It's remember the show where they set up like the night vision cameras. You look for ghosts and things that have happened. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We should if we had that equipment. I would have taken readings, and it would have been off the charts in this place. I, I don't know what to say. I, also, you if you look now on Priceline, like I saw it today for thirty two dollars. Yeah, we went on a deal hot got, week. We got it was hot. Yeah, yeah. I mean, they were beating down the doors to get in this place, but we went. So there were like four <laughs> cars in the entire parking lot. Yeah, but. Keep never mind. The pool, uh, was, the pool was sparkling clean, by the way. The pool, the pool was. There were two people swimming laps in the pool. The pool at the Magic Castle was a little more blue and crystalline than. The and you're pool right at next the Raptor retreat area. to the helicopter takeoff, which is beautiful. That's but true. I mean, again, we're going to leave it up to our wonderful fans, correct? Well, I mean, it's it's hard to compare because you have the classic, the Rosen. Something you reasonable have, and normal. You have a beautiful house, no, which you need to find. Perhaps a bit of cheating, but a great cheat, I will say. If what? you have, if you have like fifteen or sixteen close friends that can share 
the cost, but why not? Um, if you want to experience a Hollywood movie set, is that the right way to say it? Uh, yeah, a piece of history. A piece of history. Um, Where they filmed wanna... the Florida Project and the Blair Witch Project. Yeah. Look, and maybe a new women Yeah, not a good way. Yeah, I mean, also this could be a uh, a good dare spot between you and your friends yeah, who absolutely. can survive. Absolutely, yeah. if, if that's the thing. If I they could, don't yeah. have Halloween Horror Nights this year, yeah, you know where to go. Um, you know what you do? Let us know in the comments, not in the chat. Not now. Wanna, Wait until the show the concludes, are. and that is when the voting begins. If you're new to the show, uh, can I give them the rules? Let, let's. Is okay. that so? Each week we give you the power to decide who wins each week. But you don't do it now, although we appreciate all your comments in the chat. Feel free to talk. But when the show ends, the comments begin, and that is when the voting happens. So this week, you have uh, Jill's choice. You have Eric's, uh, what is it called? The Raptor Retreat. The Raptor, Raptor Retreat. Retreat. And you have the Hollywood filming location, Florida Project, Magic Castle. And uh, have fun with it. And, and we, we and do check it out on Netflix, early. Magic Castle. No, no, Florida, Florida, Florida Project, Project on Netflix. It did, and again, I put in this you video. You also watch Jurassic Park. <laughs> but Willem Dafoe, and again, for you Marvel fans, was the villain in the original Spider-Man. Um, no, uh, and if you if you want to go on Netflix and you want to check out the Magic Castle, there's there's this great thing that is called the first forty eight hours. <laughs> the first forty eight. Uh, again, another filming location. I'm just hitting it out of the park tonight. Absolutely. I mean, it is. It is. I'm not sure. If we saw more how, can, how convenient that you couldn't make it that day. I had to go to the dentist. You know what? We, we, we pride ourselves in great go, teeth on this show. I wanted to go two days before, but they said, like, a dude came in, just got the last spot. <laughs> the and last I, cap. I had, I had to wait. Guys, I have some sad news. I'm very happy Jill is here because next week I – will be in New York, and I cannot make it here in the studio, and I don't think it's fair to our audience uh, to not be here for the entire program. So I need to just tag out for a week, and I'll tag back in. So next week, I will be in New York, but there will still be an outside the bubble right here. I feel like what? she's earned her place. I, I need you to leave now. No, why? I don't want to leave. Why aren't we invited to New York? Why can't we do an outside the bubble? New York is outside the bubble. You know what? You're right. Let's change the whole thing we talked about before. We're all going to New York. All right. No, it's just, I know you guys have a lot to do next week, uh, and I already have plans. I haven't seen my dad in a year and a half, and I finally got a reservation time to see him at his um, veterans nursing home. So I have to fly back and see him for Father's Day. Uh, so it's very important to me, but the show must go on. It does. The show must go on. By the way, somebody's coming. Maybe it should be canceled. I'm not sure <laughs> after this last I, I love that people can, uh, cancel. Wow. Uh, comment on my shiny hat. Thank you very much. I'm already surprised Lauren isn't like commenting on my ball. Oh, yeah. yeah she it does look like a man with it a does, shaved It does head. shine. Um, I need to put a lot of lotion on it. So fresh and so clean. It got, clean. It got burned last weekend from sitting in the pool. How often do you have to apply on a head like that? Like reapply I think every five minutes. Oh, that's okay. why I walk away. That makes, sense. That makes sense. Okay. Uh, it'd be a lot easier if you just wore a beret. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I found my please wear, please I wear a beret one day. <laughs> so next week we'll be back here without Pete, apparently. Just one week and I'll be back. I'll be back. You can't go to be that easy. I guess I'm roped into this for another week. But You've been boxed into this show. <laughs> You are staying for the wigs post. Of course, and tonight I, I do want to say that as I'm sticking around tonight, even though I got to wake up at four a.m. Uh, for my flight, I am sticking around for the wigs tonight. So if you're not a wigs member, go check it out at Patreon.com/backslashwdwnt. And if you are a wigs member, I cannot wait to hang out with you in just a few momentos. Um, everybody in the chat who commented on my beautiful T-shirt, thank you very much. I wear it with pride. Um, but if you want. Not even a jeans shirt. Even more cool swag, Eric. You where did you get your T-shirt? The cool. Well, uh, yeah, you, I guess you can get this carouselofproducts.com. Okay, yeah. Right, the finest merchandise on this planet. Ah, uh, well, it is uh, made by the finest craftsmen that we could find. It is uh, curated by the most brilliant minds in the industry. Go to carouselofproducts.com. T-shirts, magnets, pens. 
all that kind of stuff. We have and we have new stuff showing up all the time. It's like the mermaid store we're online. Oh my god, the mermaid, mermaid store. store. What a gem. Two stories of fun uh, and someone what was your girl's name? name? Uh Salariel. 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 Yeah. Salariel. Beautiful. 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 No, carouselproducts.com. We got awesome merchandise. Check it out. Yeah, absolutely. I get paid zero dollar commission, so that's good for me too. Yeah, that's true. He does. Oh, absolutely. So, Jill, you get zero. Our first, our first episode comes to an end. How, how did you, how did you enjoy this? It was great fun. I am also somewhat traumatized. <laughs> <laughs> but the laughs were worth it. So the laughs were definitely, uh, especially from my side, who did not have to witness this. <laughs> absolutely loved it. Thank you all for being here again. Uh, a big thank you uh, to my three good friends and Jason Diffendahl for uh, joining along on the, the adventures. I will say someone said excellent editing, and Axel does all the editing every week, so big shout out to Axel as well. Um, and, yeah, for Eric, thank you, Loma Holmes, for letting right. us crash yes. your place. Yep. We do appreciate that. Which stands for Ladies of Massachusetts. So thank you so much. <laughs> We will be back next week without Pete, but with Jill. But the week right after, I'm back. Pete will be back. So and then he'll be gone. And then he got uh, such as Mango. Uh, you know, <laughs> thank you all for watching. Uh, post show. Who should stay around? Post show coming up. Who should stay around? Is there a wig? Thank you, Don. The wig the members. Around. Thank you, Chief. We'll be with our wigs members in just a few moments. My right? And my www.t.com. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah. Thank you, you for watching. Make you know sure to have liked this video, subscribe, and we will be back next week. Same bad time, same bad channel. See you next week. Peace.